A cosmic collision, and it's all caught on camera tonight. NASA intentionally tried to nudge a harmless asteroid that is 7 million miles away from Earth. It's kind of like a bug on a windshield, but in this case, NASA scientists are hoping a spacecraft traveling 14,000 miles will crash into the space rock and push it slightly off course. The purpose of the unprecedented test is to see if it would work in the event an asteroid was really going to hit Earth. So mission accomplished, but we really won't know if it worked for a couple of days or even weeks. But we start the conversation with a new segment at 10 at the table. And we want to welcome Dr. Jean Creighton, director of the UW-Milwaukee Planetarium. She joins us at the table tonight. So quite the galactic experiment. Why did we do this and what do you think we're going to learn? We want to have choices. <laughs> there are about 25,000 objects in the solar system that are considered near-Earth objects. Okay. That means they get within 10% of the distance between the Earth and the Sun. That's pretty close. <laughs> and if they are uh, big, let's say, several times a football field, mm -hmm. they could take out life on Earth as really? we know it. Wow. Yes. Now, there are variations, right? Some of these asteroids can be as small as a house. Some of them can be as big as Texas. Mm. Hopefully, the Texas isn't going to hit us because then yeah. probably we don't have any tools for it. Or any choices. Or any choices, <laughs> yes. And yes. this one wasn't going to hit us. We knew this one wasn't going no. to. No. Yeah. But the hope is that since we are tracking about 150 objects that we consider potentially hazardous, that if we see, oh, this one, this one, this could hit us in 30 years, some small intervention like what we did today might help us miss it by a thousand miles. So how much calculation needs to be thought of to worry whether or not an asteroid will really crash into Earth? Well, we always have an uncertainty of exactly what its orbit is. And the more data we collect, the better we narrow that. So the point is, if we see something that we think Mm, that looks a little too close. We would start tracking it closely, and then we would say, okay, that guy we need to do something about. Well, I'm glad there's people to think about that guy we need to do something about. <laughs> Thanks for coming in.